Join us at the Prompt Nugget Hotel and Casino with the number one gaming experience and entertainment. The Prompt Nugget has the number one dining experience at Stockman Steakhouse, Golden Harvest Cafe, and the Gold Miners Buffet. Come get your game on at the Prompt Nugget Hotel and Casino. Today's news is brought to you in part by Dr. George Leakes, Pahrump's optometrist since 1990, offering full-spectrum eye care for children and adults. Call today, 727-8300. And welcome back to News 46. The Clark County Office of the Coroner has determined that Sarah Gouliet Gouillard, a performer in Ka by Cirque du Soleil, died on Saturday from multiple blunt force trauma suffered when she fell approximately 90 feet. Gouliet Gouillard is 31 years old and was a citizen of France and a resident of Las Vegas. The manner of her death was accidental. And let's join Sharon at West Star Ranch Animal Rescue with today's Save a Pet. Save a Pet is generously brought to you by Auto World at 727-8000 and Greenspan Brokerage at 751-6200. Put the green team to work for you. Hi, my name is Sharon. I'm here at West Star Ranch Animal Rescue. I'm here to show you this wonderful male dog named Ace. He's approximately three years old. He's up for adoption. He's a rot shepherd mix. We're open from 10 till 3, Wednesday through Sunday. We're located at 780 East Mance Road. Please come down and see us. If you would like to sponsor Save a Pet, give us a call at 727-9400. To adopt, donate, or contact West Star Ranch, call 727-9273. And on Monday, a special class will be offered at the University of Nevada Cooperative Extension. We have uh, our Grow Your Own classes coming up, and this starts July 8th. Uh, they're Mondays from 2.30 to 4.30. Mm -hmm. Cost for the program, they're $10 per class, or they can attend the eight sessions for $40. There you go. What's Grow Your Own consist of? Well, it uh, consists of classes, uh, a community garden, um, composting in small places, reducing food safety risks, in school and community gardens, kids in the garden, what's wrong with my plant, mm -hmm. urban organic farming, uh, native plants for garden pollinators, and garden design and function. You don't need any uh, any other um, prerequisites or any things that you need to take beforehand, and do you need any materials? Well, no, all you have to do is come into the office at, located at 1651 East Calvada Boulevard or call me at 775-727 5532. We do have a registration. They can fill it out mm -hmm. and attend the class. Just come, up, come in and bring a pencil. That's it. A fireworks display will be held tomorrow night at the Nugget. Here's Jeff Simmons with more that is happening this weekend. Hi, everybody. This is Jeff Simmons, a bingo director here at the Prom Nugget. Uh, we'll start off with our stage bar tonight. We have Little Elmo and the Cosmos. And we also have outdoors tomorrow. Uh, on the parking lot, we have a live DJ. We'll have the bouncy house for the kids, pie eating contest, a lot of activities going on outside the Nugget in the north parking lot. And that's all the festivities start at 4 o'clock tomorrow afternoon, or Saturday afternoon. And then uh, we'll go with bingo. Uh, we got a barbecue we're going to have for all of our 11 a.m. session players on July 14th. It's a Sunday. So come play the 11 o'clock session, and directly after the bingo session we'll have barbecued hammers and hot dogs for all the players and then uh, we have no split pots every night at 9 p.m. and our lower buy-ins are every day at the 11 1 7 and 9 p.m. sessions and all sessions on Sundays and Mondays and also over at go town Kathy's continuing her paper only no split pots that's at 11 a.m. every day and then 9 p.m. on Fridays only they have no split pots with electronics so. Come on down, Go Town, Nugget, and Lakeside. We've got lots of things going on. Looking forward to seeing you here. And also, one more thing, we do have our fireworks show Saturday night, and that starts at 9 p.m. Looking forward to seeing everybody here. Bye-bye. Yeah, I can't wait for the fireworks tomorrow night, uh, but last night's fireworks were fa fantastic. Yes, they were exciting. You know, Mother Nature added her own fireworks display as well. We'll find out more about that and your weather coming up this weekend right after the break. News 46 weather is brought to you by Healthcare Partners Medical Group with five locations in Pahrump. Local doctors and professional staff providing total care from infancy to seniors. News 46 weather is also brought to you by your local dairy farmers. 
Dairy products are very important in maintaining a healthy body. For more information, you can visit their website at nevadadairycouncil.org. Welcome back. It is Friday. Going to start off weather a little bit different. So I have a picture for you of the 4th of July, Independence Day. Thank you to Jamie Lentz who put this on our local prompt page. So as you can see, you got the fireworks going on in the background and then this bolt of lightning coming down and striking the ground. Amazing picture. There was a lot going on that day. You had thunder, which I found was actually somewhat louder than the fireworks. You got the fireworks themselves. You got lightning. You got some rain and then the fire going on in Carpenter Canyon. So a lot going on. But looking at our weather here, what, would, what do we have today? So we have sunny skies, 106 for your high. So actually not as hot. Winds coming out of the south southwest at 11, gusts at 19. So a little bit, you'll feel some, some winds. 16% humidity, 5.33 a.m. sunrise, and a record high of 116 degrees in 1943. What we're having tonight, mostly clear skies, 80 for your low. Winds coming out of the south at 8, gusts at 17. So the skies lately, they're, they're, uh, the visibility is a little bit low because there's a lot of particulate matter being thrown up in the air, plus with that fire. Just so visibility, you don't have that great. 20% humidity, 8.05 p.m. sunset, and a record low, 60 degrees in 1938. And looking on to Saturday, partly cloudy skies, 103 for your high, 79 for your low. Winds somewhat calmer, 15% humidity, 5.33 a.m. sunrise, and UV index staying at 11. So our seven-day forecast, no more of those 110, 113 degree highs, no more of those 80 degree lows. So what you're seeing here is highs around low 100 degree range, lows staying around mid to upper 70s. Thanks so much, Ian, for that. And thank you for Jamie for that photo. Jamie Lentz providing us that photo of the firework and the lightning there. On Saturday, July 6th, the Prompt Nugget will host the Summer Spectacular beginning at 4 p.m. The fireworks show begins at 9 p.m. in the parking lot. And, of course, I'd like to add to that, Jamie, that we should go get some lottery tickets because the odds of getting a lightning bolt with a firework explosion at the same time are pretty rare. But anyways, off 160 Coffee House, 1330 South Highway 160, will host a reggae blues fest from 6 p.m. to midnight on Saturday. Jamaican singer Stan Rankin will perform. There will be Jamaican jerk chicken and island crafts available, and all ages are welcome. And the Outer U Salon is inviting the public to an Arbonne Day Spa uh, this Sunday at 3 p.m. Free to observe, have fun while learning more about how to improve your health and skin care as well as a business opportunity. The Outer U is located on the corner of Prompt Valley Boulevard and Calvada. And that's going to do it for this edition of News 46 from everyone up here on the hill. We wish you a wonderful night. I'm Deanne O'Donnell. And I'm Jason Koblenz. Good night. Good night.